In this video, I will show you how to set up a time condition with VoIP.ms. With this feature, you can route your incoming calls to different destinations depending on the time of the call. First, log into the customer portal. Navigate over to DID numbers and click Time Conditions. In order to create a time condition, click the Create a new time condition button. First, we need to configure at least one criteria. You can configure up to four different criteria at the moment. For example, let's say that the business hours are from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and Monday to Friday. Note that all servers are set to Eastern Standard Time, EST, regardless of their geographic location. Next, you can do two options. The first one is destination if one of the conditions matches server time this option will tell the server where the incoming call will be routed if the time match one of the criteria above. The second one is Destination if no conditions matches the server time. This option will tell the server where the incoming call will be routed if the time doesn't match any of the criteria above. As you can see, you have several options to route the incoming calls. SIP IAX, your main account or one of your sub-accounts, IVR, calling queue, another time condition, a call forwarding, etc. In this example, we will set that all the calls are routed to the main account in business hours or the voicemail in the non-business hours. Finally, you only need to name it, for example, business hours. Note that you have maximum 15 characters available. Once this is set, you will need to route your incoming calls from your DID to your time condition. First, you need to go back to your customer portal. Navigate over to DID numbers, then Manage DID, and then click on the Edit button. Once you are on the DID settings, you need to select the Time Conditions option, and then select it from the drop-down menu on the right. To finish, only apply the changes, and you should have the time conditions working for the DID. And this is how you can set up a time condition with VoIP.ms. Let us know if you have any questions. Thanks!